Carl, at the start of the season, we were in the club shop, uh, you were introducing the new kit, and you said that you wanted to, you had a bee in your bonnet, and you wanted to make sure you got that out of your the relegation out of your system. Do you think you've done that this season? Um, over the whole course of the season, I think I have. Um, obviously, I would have liked to get off to a better start, but um, it wasn't to be. Um, since then, there was a lot of changes, and it was really difficult. There was a lot of stuff going on off the pitch, which made it difficult for us on the pitch, but it's not an excuse. We, we believe we should have started the season better and we would have given ourselves a fighting chance. Um, but it's one of those things, it, it never happened, and then we ended up chasing our tails since day one, and, and it wasn't to be. But um, I think looking back at the season now, we've, we've had a good few performances, and the fans have been fantastic and got behind us. So uh, if they do that for us next season and, and we hit the ground running, then who knows what, what will happen at this club. Triple sweep, you know? Incredible, I suppose. It's the best feeling in the world, to be honest. I'm trying to stop myself from smiling. Um, to go home to, to your family, your wife and your kids and, and take three trophies home um, and the ones that won last week as well off the supporters clubs is, is the best feeling in the world, to be honest. It just makes you feel really appreciated. And I think I've played over 50 games this season and obviously I felt a, a bit tired the last, the last month or so, if I'm honest, but um, I wanted to play in as many games as possible and, and be part of everything that went on this season. And, and thankfully, I've done that. Um, I was happy to chip in with 15 goals, and I'd swap everything I've got for, for promotion, if I'm being honest. But um, hopefully, that'll come next year. And uh, as of this year, and I'd, I'd like to thank everyone who's voted for me for the player awards. And no one, no player uh, that's ever been at this club is more grateful, and, and I can put my hand on my heart and say, say that means so much to me. 56 appearances, I think it is. Then you've got. 15 goals and then you're top of the assist league as well so is it difficult to pull out one moment which you think wow that was that was brilliant um, there's been a lot of good moments I think um, it's probably not as difficult as what you think I think the day I got the captain's armband was, was probably my proudest moment of the whole season um, I think obviously when Mark Robbins come in and we went to the Emirates and, and obviously we played Arsenal away and um, to get the armband on me peg there was, was the proudest moment probably of my career, um, if I'm being honest, and, and since then I think it gave me the extra 5 or 10 percent I needed to go on through the season, and I know how big this club is, and I know how passionate the fans are, so to be captain of a club like this um, is, is, is a great achievement for me personally, um, I'm disappointed we never delivered and got them promotion, and I'm, I'm devastated we never took them to Wembley in the JPT, but um, we give it our all, and we give 110 percent every game we played in, it was difficult, Obviously, losing the 10 point deduction, I think we lost a bit of momentum after that and, and struggled in the last month or so. Um, but I've got a really good feeling about next season, and, and I'm, the lads are positive about it. The gaffer's come in and, and done a great job, and I, I believe in him and I believe in Neil as assistants, and hopefully, they'll take us to where we need to be.